here we go. First time Again. ever. Again, first time on, on this road. Yeah. So we far are it's looking good. Yes, always looking good when it's a forested road. <laughs> we are in the same area, our county, and uh, close to the national park Muntia Posen. Mm -hmm. And this is basically a forested road. Yeah. We just uh, came off of the county road that goes from uh, Pietrosa, Beyush Pietrosa to Padish, which is inside the national park Montepusen. Oh my god, babe, I love it. I love it as well. Challenging a little bit, but not bad. Not bad. Oh, not bad at all, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit drifting because on the middle uh, are big sto uh, small stones in mm -hmm. a group, you know? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Together and uh, if you go through there, drifting a little bit, but it's cool. It is, it is. We like challenges. <laughs> <laughs> it looks a bit flat. It's like it. It definitely rain. Uh huh. But like here now it's dry. That means yeah. it wasn't that big of a rain. We came today to the forest because I think this is one of the last days of uh, good weather because now it's autumn in Romania. Yes. And a really high temperature. Yeah. But you see, it used to be asphalt on this road. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, I saw some sections. Mm -hmm. Maybe back in communist times. I mean, yeah, all like the most of the roads. Uh -huh. Yeah, were done there. Was done there at that time. Now, uh, yeah. Vlad, show me these days a video with two guys which the other one put the legs always down going on forest roads and he was uh, laughing uh, because on the downhill yeah because uh, he said uh, he i i'm he didn't say but uh, i imagine that he was referring to me and now i'm trying not to put my legs down because you know you show weakness if you do that one more time so now I'm trying my best, you guys. Well, babe, the problem is when we go downhill, because <laughs> <laughs> up, that, because that was the problem. The, the guy uh, had no experience, like yeah. uh, like us. Me? And, he, <laughs> and no, because I also don't have experience. Yeah. And, and he was going really slow. The other yeah, yeah, guy yeah. who was uh, experiment chat, yeah, he he wasn't uh, patient at all with uh, the new guy, so he no, kept no, pushing no. him. Just go, yeah. go, 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 go! Don't go. put your legs. Don't. <laughs> Why go so weak? And, yeah. Oh my they God. were Romanians. So, it was so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, then, my radio is on. Oh, <laughs> radio, radio on. Wait, stop here, cause it's so loud. Yeah. Yeah, no problem. Jesus, why uh, this uh, car do turn... Place the radio oh, okay. randomly. This is very... very unusual. I mean, not for us. We have to do a bit of a research to, to see if uh, is this a common problem or Can is you it hear me now? just our units. Maybe. Hear me now? Just our units, we'll see. All good? Yeah. I can't hear him. Hmm. Is my car the on? You good? Yeah, yeah, now. Good. We are okay, <laughs> no radio. <laughs> I don't know why car do start radio, playing yeah, that, radio. I was saying that I'll look into it to see if this is common or is it just our units? For yeah, some I reason. don't know. Yeah, we'll, yeah. Uh, we'll try to 
check the forums. Yeah. To see. I'm sad now because I don't have. Um, I'm. I mean, I don't know. I am unco feeling uncomfortable because I don't have my sunglasses on, and I don't want to put the visor and I feel like my eyes are not protected especially in the forest when everything can uh, yeah but jump why don't you in. have yours <laughs> your sunglasses I, I put them in the tank back because I uh -huh. thought I will not see the forest <laughs> perfectly with the sunglasses because some parts are shadowy if this is correct and um, yes okay yeah you want it basically a better visibility. Yeah. Totally understandable if you are a beginner. <laughs> like 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 us. <laughs> ah okay, now he he uh, saved himself because yeah. he said like us. Otherwise <laughs> this is what but it wait, is. I do have my sunglasses. Yeah, but uh, you are a beginner. Yeah, okay. Not with driving skills, because he's professional driver. No motorcycle. Either. No <laughs> motorcycle. No, no, no. Oh my God! I love it, Brick. Oh my God! Look at the uh, left Very. side. Yeah. Very dangerous. We, we kept, we kept climbing. Yeah. And we still go up. But this is, yeah, this is like a forestry road that crosses the mountain basically so uh -huh, uh -huh. we expect very good things <laughs> from this road and we'll end up in a familiar area where we've been already hopefully we shall see mm -hmm. we only hope that this road is open yeah and not uh, uh, blocked by a yeah. barrier or something at some point we will check if no, if it's blocked, we will go back and try another. Another trust. day. Yeah. <laughs> not, not all day are good days. Good day. Fuck it. <laughs> if you have a bad day, fuck it. <laughs> oh, okay. this is also uh, a trail. By the looks of it, I saw this uh, blue circle marking. Ah, okay. For touristy well, trail. Mm -hmm. Walking trail, huh? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Hiking. Hiking, yeah. It's nice. Oh my god, we are still up already. Yeah. We have some opening there. Good, good. Good opening. Uh -huh. Yeah. Beautiful. Wow. <laughs> I love it. As you can see, for me, looks scared down the, the downhill, and I'm going a little bit towards right. <laughs> yeah, always it, it's good practice because you can lose control of the yeah. motorcycle. So then, at least you have one two seconds extra. Yeah, so easily, and it's not like I think I will fall there, but the motorcycle definitely will if I will lose control. You know, because I can jump uh, much easier that then i can stop my bike because the bike yeah. is heavy always it's uh, nice uh, weather cool weather in the forest yeah it's so feeling so, so good beautiful this september was so good guys yeah. So, uh, second half of August until now, it's already, I don't know, already half September, something like that. It was so good weather, way better yeah. than July and June this yeah. summer. It was very rainy in Romania this mm -hmm. summer, but... So, just so you know, because if you decide to visit September, it's still a great month. Mm -hmm. to visit Romania it's and it's highly recommended because it's not so busy yeah like like anywhere you know touristy August it's gone so through that 
you will have it all for yourself, basically. And the cheaper price is everywhere. Yeah. Compared with August. Oh, uh, huh, yeah. I don't know, but that, but yeah, <laughs> Romanians are greedy bastards. So. Ah, uh, yeah. We also have to take that in consideration, man. Yeah. But everywhere is the same. People are people. Some people good, some people. Yeah. Not all people are good people. No. <laughs> and if they are not, you need to fight them. Never <laughs> let them take your money. Fight for yourself. <laughs> I mean, sure, yeah. Sounds uh, sound nice, but not, uh, not here. <laughs> <laughs> because you know hotel prices who are you yeah. going to argue with yeah so if you need to sleep you have to pay yeah oh wow I, I caught a small rock Shit. And you drifted, drifted. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Best feeling. <laughs> Small rocks here on this road, which easily you can lose control. Yeah, a bit of gravel. Yeah. Not so far. It's a walk in the park, this road. Yeah. Very good road. Mm hmm. I love it as well. And we're going down. Down, down, down. Don't put your legs down, down, down. I think I'm better now with downhills. I become a little bit better. After I showed you that video, probably. Yeah, 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 because I don't <laughs> want to show weakness. Of course, people will laugh and say you are so weak and I don't want, I want to be strong, independent woman. <laughs> <laughs> strong you are, babe, very strong. As in jungle, if you show weakness, you are dead. <laughs> exactly. Uh -huh. Same here. The relationship uh, options go down, food down, everything. Mm -hmm. Just these advantages. Yeah. And we're off. Yeah. Oh, my days, babe. I believe. Or not. No, no. Oh, are we, are we going right? There's the road. Look on the other side. Oh, huh? uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Jesus, where it collapsed? The hill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hopefully we can pass that We can, section. we can, because it's clear. Yeah? Mm -hmm. They still use it, probably, or why they maintain it. Yeah, What? I mean... What is... Oh! <laughs> wow. wow! That's so beautiful! <laughs> yeah. Cheile Galbene! Oh! Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is the mm -hmm. circuit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so cool! Ooh, nice. Those are you saying? Yes, what we need. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this is where we came from. Oh my days! On the this other side. Collapsed. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Now that's something <laughs> beautiful. I love it. No. Oh. I didn't know that I like uh, going on a uh, dirt bike through the forest in the weekend. <laughs> Seems like I do. <laughs> yeah. It's like I love it. Yeah. <laughs> you cannot not do. Oh, how, yeah. How, how do I say this? Yeah. It's impossible not to love something <laughs> like this. 
Yeah, 100%. And we go up again. People oft, often ask me, but it's not dangerous, you know? Because uh, even in my imagination, before starting riding the motorcycle, was like a dangerous thing to do, but it's not that dangerous as it looks. No. No, of course it can be if, uh, I, mean, I don't know, you increase the speed and you cannot control it. It can be like through the death. Yeah, but even going, you know, slow is dangerous. It's more dangerous than driving a car from your home to the supermarket, <laughs> you yeah. know? Yeah. But beyond the danger, there's the mm -hmm. feeling and people who like these activities, you know? Yeah. And challenging themselves mm -hmm. and then finding pleasure, right? Because of yeah. this dopamine that it gives you, obviously, then for people like us, it's not like dangerous, you know? Yeah. I read in a book, The Road Through the Character is the name of the book, and it says uh, people who live by the pleasure, just for the pleasure, they don't have a happy life. But people who live through the challenges and uh, challenge themselves, they end up having a much happier uh, life than the other ones. Yes, of course. And it makes so much sense because uh, uh, at the first time it looks like uh, challenging makes you sad and uh, frustrating, but mm, it's totally contrary, you know, at the okay, end. Because facing challenges and then uh, getting past them, you mm -hmm. know, then mm -hmm. the reward comes. So yeah, yeah, yeah. You keep finding new stuff in your life to keep it interesting, to have your soul, you know, keep going and looking mm -hmm. for these awesome feelings that it gives you, facing yeah. challenges and a boring life, a normal boring life like most people do have, you know, mm -hmm. that yeah. uh, keeps them uh, not busy at all. Then you have time to think yeah. uh, things that are uh, negative, you know, for yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because if you don't do anything, right, you don't have a, a hobby and uh, beyond your work, I mean. Yeah, 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 true that. And obviously, you invest all that energy you have extra into negative thoughts and thinking and attitude and then, you know. Yeah. But people Be like us, we invest our energy into something that gives us, you know, these amazing feelings. So mm -hmm. obviously, we're going to be happier, you know. Yeah, and I struggled that? becoming like that because in the first place, I was the same as you describe uh, the majority of people having a job which I hated, of course. And uh, I tried doing something with my life, but I didn't know exactly what to do, how to start, from where to start. I didn't have any support, you know, and mm -hmm. it's totally so frustrating living like that. Exactly. And it's really an unhappy thing. It's not worth it. Oh, babe, I told you. You can be happy with a boring life if you are smart. Again, but for that you need to develop your brain. Yeah. And then it's very rare uh, of intelligent people that choose a boring life, you know? Yeah. Usually it's not the case, like 99% of the people choose to do something, even though it doesn't need to be like physical, you know, like yeah. outdoor, but you can still do something. Yeah, uh-oh. Yeah, don't worry, just go. Local people. Razia? Yeah, they work in the forest. Oh, they have a tractor there. <laughs> oh, another one. Oh, these are just tourists, maybe? Uh -oh. 
Probably. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why he chose this path. <laughs> oh my fucking hell. <laughs> when the brain gives you uh, errors. <laughs> no, but what's funny is that uh, it made you insecure then, you know, because you were in the middle, you, you know, you were yeah. on the track, then you had to switch, and... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And even my b brain gives me error, error 404. <laughs> Remember <laughs> in Indonesia. <laughs> Remember <laughs> it. <laughs> oh, guys, so we had literally the most interesting <laughs> event that have ever Shocking. happened to us. Shocking event. <laughs> oh my days, it was so funny. So basically, we were walking and uh, by the edge of the road, because in uh, uh, Asian countries, most of them, you don't have uh, sidewalks, right? So you walk yeah. on the side of the road and at some point, some guy, oh, look at this old, uh, <gasps> I am as a MSL babe, it's called. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Oh my god, yeah. Oh my god, looks so cool. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love it. Uh, so while we were walk walking, I don't know how uh, we stopped, babe, or we were just... No, no, no. We no, continue. No. Yes, so we were walking and suddenly a local on a motorbike comes off of the main road, it's like he was coming from uh, his property or something, right? Yeah, I don't know, some uh, land probably, he worked yeah, yeah. there. Or... or yeah, working in the fields, something, yeah. something like that. And uh, so instead of <laughs> going uh, either in front of us or waiting for us to pass and then yeah. he would have been cleared, uh -huh. He we stopped. To... When we yeah. saw him, uh, we stopped to yeah. give him pri priority, you know? Yeah, oh, yeah, exactly, because we were afraid no? that yeah. we will go basically over us. So we stopped to give him, and I think we were holding hands or... Yeah, or yeah, something like that. Something like that. And guess what? He chose to drive the scooter between us. <laughs> so That was the shock of our life. We couldn't believe this. Yeah, so I, I believe he touches both of us, or I, 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 don't, I don't remember exactly, but basically he squeezed in between yeah. us. <laughs> and he had plenty of space because nobody was on the road, nobody. Exactly. No and car was plenty. coming. <laughs> and in front, in the back, he has so much space. But no, he chose. Oh my, that was like 404 error. <laughs> Oh my god, we had so much fun. Yeah. We, every time we remember that, we keep laughing. Because yeah. it was literally the strangest yeah. thing ever. Yeah. So some tourists. It happens, shit happens. <laughs> when you travel a lot, so it's many things happening. happens which you never up. thought about them. Didn't expect that that oh, is wait, possible. Wait, 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 we need to stop. 